Alright, I'm Sovereign Sage, and it's been about four days since I've played this, and apparently the next part of the story for the Albedo Mountain thing has opened up now. So I guess we're gonna go look at it. As soon as I put characters in. Checking my bonuses. I try to switch out my characters. I try to put different people at different places, but sometimes I don't really think it really matters where I put people. Unless it's like based on that region, like Chang Yun here. Because he's a Liyue character, um, when you put him in that region, um, the time consumed to search is reduced by like 25%. So like he can come back faster versus other characters that take like longer. But, um, isn't Yan Fei also a Liyue character? And so is Child. You would think they would all have that same time consumption bonus. But they don't. And I, I'm a kind of, I'm not annoyed by it. I just find it weird that they also don't have that. It's not a big deal. It's just, you know. It's like, come on, what the hell are we doing here? I keep sending Fischl out there. She's probably like, why do you keep sending me here? I'm burning alive. I don't know why. Let's see something for a minute, though. Put this down for a second. I need to see if I have a hundred of something, 150 of something. I want to do the element thing, because you can get rewards from it. I usually use Barbara and sometimes the Electro Archon. But normally I would always just use Barbara because you can attack without having to use actually energy or anything. You could just spam it. Like, because she's the only magical type um, that I have in my team that can, you could just spam the circle button. As were other characters, it's like a physical <coughs> swing, you see? And with her, it's like, woo! So. We have put in much every work of late and... Yeah, okay, every time she says that, I, um, I always hear we are Siamese, if we please. <laughs> we are Siamese, if you please. Like, every time she says we have, my mind automatically goes to the... I don't know why, it's just that song. I must have, like, a bunch of those by now. I don't really need more fabric. Mm. All right. Yeah. Goodbye. If you ever have any No. If you ever have anything you want to say, you should probably fuck off. <laughs> It'd be funny if she said that. <laughs> I don't know where I why I said that. The one, the one before, before you is isn't... Yeah, the one before me is known as <sighs> the guy in the teacup. Okay. Um give me this cat. Do I want another dog? I have one on my garden, so all right, let's let's look at the map. I mean, I could run all the way up there, but it would take time, so we're gonna do this. I hate how it doesn't let me use one of my things here. And I'll show you what I mean in a minute. Okay. What a calming noise. I don't know if you can hear it. That. What is that sound? Is the plats doing that? Or no, it was my portal. It was this making that sound. Yeah. I love my garden. Look at how pretty my garden is. I love that. Really, I, I, I love bamboo trees. Like, I, I want to live in an entire forest of just those. Like a, like a medium-sized house in the middle surrounded by like a billion of those. That's my dream. Yeah, see, I have a dog over here. Where are you, doggy? There's a dog. Look at the dog. Yeah, I don't even have room for another one, even if I want it anyway, so. Let's see. 
Man, my level's low. Alright, let's teleport back to the house, because having her run all the way there um, would take like 50,000 years. And it's quick! It's, look, I'm already here. <laughs> so, um... So... I don't have enough room to place this cat anywhere, but basically... Um, wasn't there a button that allowed me to move quicker? Oh yeah, it's the D-pad. Um, so I have Chang Yun outside, and Razor and Child, and then I have Yan Fei. But inside I have um, the Electral, the Electro Archon. Why did she just drop? Did you see that? <laughs> I guess the loading. So when you level up the characters' friendship levels, you can tell if they have new dialogue. So it usually gets like a little white bubble with black dots, like an ellipsy bubble. It'll be above their character image on the map. And that's how I've noticed that if they have something to say to me, um, they'll do that. So you have a cat here, and then I have another one upstairs next to the Electro Archon. Yeah, right here. Yeah, see, look, there's a bubble over her head. So that means she has something new to say. Oh, oh it's, it's you. you. Perhaps, Perhaps you have come, come just, just to see me? me? Uh, yeah. Would you like to have a chat with me? Yes. yes. I, just I just so happen, happen to have, have something that I would like, like to ask you. you. Oh, really? What's that? I would, I would like, like to know, know how you make, make such delicious desserts. desserts. <laughs> Rot. <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, I mean, they, they certainly, certainly seem, seem to, suit to suit my taste. The most important ingredient is patience. The most important ingredient is hope. The most ingre important ingredient is patience. I see. I see. Though, Though your, your attempts, attempts may, may fail, fail, you will, you will not, not give up future attempts, attempts because of a temporary, temporary setback. setback. Sure. By, By making adjustments along the way, you, you compile, compile what you've learned, learned and, and accumulate experience. experience. True. Is, is that, that what you mean? mean? Exactly. I see. I'll, I'll be sure, sure to remember to that. that. Now that, that I've benefited from your experience, experience I'll, try I'll try to follow your instructions, instructions the next time I'm attempting optimizations on the show. Oh, so that's what this is about. I have a feeling that it's not learning how to make desserts that you're after. <laughs> see, they always have multiple choice questions, and I'm like, oh, so this is what this is about. Um, yeah, because she, it's already noted that the Raiden Shogun cannot cook, so her asking about food is kind of like a red flag. It's like, wait a minute. Um, I have a feeling that's not learning how to make desserts that you're after. Or, oh, so that's what this is about. Well, I kind of want to see her response to both, but I'll just say this. Hmm? Haven't have I already, already mentioned, mentioned that, that I cannot, I cannot make, make food? food? Yeah, I know. See, I, I see I knew it. However, the advice you gave me will benefit you as well. With a more powerful shogun, I will be able to protect you from a myriad of dangers even more effectively. Oh? Alright, let's talk to her again. Oh, it's you. Perhaps you have come just... Yes. I just so happen to have something I would like to know how you make I mean... They, they certainly, certainly seem to suit my okay. taste. Oh, I would have, I would have never, never expected that, that trying to make desserts taste, taste better was an expression of hope. But, but no. The more, the more I, think I think about it, 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 it can't possibly, possibly be that simple. simple. Perhaps hope means the, the desire, desire to satisfy the eater. Uh, exactly. I, I see. see. I'll, I'll be sure, sure to remember that. that. Now, now that, that I've benefited from your experience, experience I'll, I'll try, try to, follow to follow your instructions, your instructions the, the next time I'm attempting I'm optimization. I'm feeling that it's not learning how to make desserts that you're after. Hmm? Haven't, Haven't I already, already mentioned that, that I cannot make food? food? However, the, the advice you gave me will benefit you as well, with, with a more, more powerful, powerful shogun. shogun. Okay. She just says the same thing to both lines. Alright. Then, uh, never mind. <laughs> we need to place that other cat somewhere. Well, we have one on one side of the room, so... <coughs> I feel like I'm dying. <coughs> I, 
I keep on forgetting that it's the D-pad arrows, and this is how slow it moves. I'm sorry, I can't make it go any faster. Where do, what side do I want them on? Um... Dee -dee 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 Let's put this other cat. Um, well, let's see. I have one over there. So we can have one. Where do I want this cat? Right here, I guess? Doesn't really matter. Except for I screwed up my camera and now I'm like super zoomed in. Okay. Okay, so now we have two, two, I guess they'll be my twin cats on the first floor. And that other one, I don't know if you even saw it, was up here, uh, near her. Yeah, here's the other one. Oh. <laughs> Wee. Alright. Yeah, so you can tell uh, if their friendship level gets high enough. They have new dialogue, so they'll have a little ellipsy bubble over their face. It's kind of a neat touch, though, because now you know if the characters have something to say to you or not. Looks like, um, Chang Yun doesn't have anything to say. Oh, hello. New rumors? Yeah, I heard about some guy called Itaki something, Ito something. Uh, apparently he's a character in this game and I've never even heard of him or seen him and there's another woman that's like a cryo character with like gray hair and a feather in her hair or some shit. I don't know if they're gonna be new characters but they look like they're out of place. Hello. That was a quick turn child. You're gonna freak me out. Go, Barbara, go. Go. Woo. <laughs> How much is what worth? My bill? Girl, this is a bell of time. It has no price. Like, can you put a price on life? No, you can't, can you? Also, Barbara's taller than you. Oh no, they're about the same height. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. They didn't have anything to say. I don't know what the highest... I think the highest friendship level you can get is 10. And I can have a field day with that because I have so many characters, you just switch them out randomly. What I'm trying to do is max out my favorite characters first, get their friendship levels the highest, and then put in alternating characters. But Yanfei's not really one of my favorites though, is she? No, I may mean, like her, but um, Barbara, hello? She's like, here I am. With the lagging bubbles and the untextured fog. Oh, Alright, um. Oh, I can't. Ah, oh, crap. No. Duh. Alright, what I was talking about when I cut myself off earlier was I was saying this, this thing here, they don't let you use it in your player home. As tall as my big sister. I don't know why they don't let you, but they're like, no. I need 150 of something. I can put in cabbages. Because I don't want to really want to use these. Because I was using those to try to make a weapon. And I have a bunch of these. I can farm a shit ton of these. Because I put a bunch of markers where, where, where there's like a whole bunch of them. And oh my god. If I was to farm them every day. I would have like way more over a thousand. If I was to actually take the time to do it every day. Which I don't really care to. Which I don't. So... All right, let's put the cabbages in. Illusion shattered. Can't even like see her for a minute. There is no escape. Oh, there we go. So, like, you used the Electro Archon to help you, therefore, we'll give you a thing. That eye being above me is ominous as shit. Oh, it follows me everywhere. Alright, that was for her, so let me... Crap. Shit. She needs... She needs... She needs one more than that. 
actually, uh... Yeah, because I was saving these. My, they, they're like, want me to level up the characters. Oh, he needs one more. Um... Like, her? I don't really want to do it, because I was saving these in case I got Albedo. Damn. I didn't want to give them to her, though, because she's not a character I use, but I might as well just try to do it, otherwise it, it's never going to stop telling me. And I actually don't like Rosaria. I don't really care for her at all. I personally don't. Like, her weapon style is cool, and her element is okay, but, like, her personally, she just didn't appeal to me, honestly. Okay. Oh, yeah, those things I got, I think it was for child. That's why I was thinking about him. I'm an idiot. I was saving these in case I got Albedo, and I'm having to waste them on her, because I don't think I'm gonna get Albedo. It'd be funny if I did, though, but I don't think so. Okay, we need to go to child really quick. Um, yeah, it was. Okay, um... That's why I recognized it. I was like, hold on a minute. Oh, I can give something to you. Okay. He's like, give me it, give me everything. Come on, Kaya, don't be like that. <laughs> He's like, give me everything right now, woman. Put it in my hands. I'll put something in your hands, but it ain't gonna be a book. All right, let's see. Damn it, she needed those too. Ah. Uh, whatever. My characters are severely under level, and I know, I know they are. But I'm working on it. So let's go do this. <laughs> Feel like I'm floating through time. All right. Okay. Oh, snowflakes! Look, Look at them at dance. dance. <laughs> Was that a new line? Don't remember her saying that. Yeah, I look like I could have just straight up cracked his head on that tree when he jumped. Oh my god. I like how somebody was trying to say that mint only grows in Liyue. When it straight up grows here, they're kind of lying. It was like a post a long time ago and it made me lose my mind. Oh hey, we're back, I guess. He's like, go participate in the training activities, and I haven't even done any of them yet. Traveler, Paimon. Um, how is your investigation going? It's been four days since I last saw you. Your faces say that perhaps you haven't turned up anything? Well, I haven't actually done those missions, so I don't know if I was supposed to find anything, so I guess I didn't. Sorry. We investigated all over the map, naturally. But we didn't, we didn't see anyone, anyone that looked, looked like you are here of anyone else, else meeting you. Yeah. This is not unexpected. I haven't made much progress either. He appears to know that we are looking for him, and has opted to lie low for the time being. But you know, it's funny, if he looks exactly like Albedo, because in the last video, or in the video before that, part 34, uh, part 134 and part 135, um, he basically said that he's a synthetic person who was created in a lab. He's basically like a tube baby. Um, and Durin, who had a different name, I think that's what he called him, the dragon kid, um, was created like him. They're basically twins. And that's why he looks exactly like him, because they're freaking twins. Um, so I was like, can he just make himself look like somebody else? But then I just remembered, no, he cannot. But there was another version where he actually has longer hair, and I've seen it, but I haven't had it happen in my game. So I'm like, is that supposed to be the other one, or it's actually Albedo with the long hair? Because it looks like it's Albedo with the long hair, and he looks pretty good like that, but, um... I don't know if that's a thing or not, but I have seen it. Or maybe he has always op I can't operated discreetly, I can't read. That's like me thinking to myself. Watch him be like, you look troubled, what is it? Still, there is one thing I found. I discovered footprints on some parts of the mountain, 
And although they were a little covered by the snow, I could tell they'd been left by someone of a similar size to myself. Oh? The footprints were quite numerous, so I believe my next step would be to rule out each of the adventurers active on Dragonspine, one by one. By what? Measuring their freaking feet? Like, can't I see if your foot matches those footprints? Turning into like a Cinderella story where instead of trying to put the glass slipper on every girl's feet, Albedo is trying to put everybody's foot in a footprint that he cut out of the snow using preservative magic. We can help that! We have plenty of contact with the adventurers. So now. Huh? The <laughs> way she just looks up without saying anything. I guess we're gonna be caved in here. Um, sound like something erupting out of something. It came from that direction. Could it be the imposter? Um, let's go look. Yes, yes let's hear it. <laughs> oh, please let me look. Oh my god. I want this shiny. No, Changying, just grab it. Grab, grab it. I thought we were being caved in, like he was trying to throw snow up from above us to cave us in here, but there, I, I just look up, there's no, the, the mountain's pretty slick and clean. There's no snow and there's no way rocks could fall from there. But if you wanted to get rid of Albedo, all you would have to do is trap him in there. It's a damn cave, you know? How hard would it be to block him from the outside? Oh, hello. I barely made out what she said because I wasn't paying attention. So what are all these rocks doing here? And then something about the boars. Okay. Rock slide? Hey, what was that? Did you see that? Did those, those rocks shake just now? Them rocks be quaking. Okay. E <gasps> that was that most was unfortunate. unfortunate. Is this supposed to be really her? Because they said the imposter- I thought the imposter could transform into other characters, and that's what I assumed, but maybe he can only- The only reason why he looks like Albedo is because he's Albedo's twin, so I guess it would be impossible for him to transform into other characters, which is what I originally thought. But I'm still trying to figure out if that's a thing, or if that's just what I think. What are you guys doing here? Oh, what the hell? Yeah, why are all of you here? I'd assume it was some sort of bad luck. I have, I have to, to agree. agree. We've been, We've been wandering, wandering this area, area for days. For days? We ran into Paladin. You, know, you know, the, uh, yeah. kind of a reckless, reckless sort of guy. Uh -huh. You know the one? Anyway, he said he was unlucky, so I gave him some adventuring survival tips. And? After that, he disappeared to rejoin the training camp. Wait, wait, wait! Are you saying that after all this time, you still haven't made it back to the base camp? <laughs> uh, well, as you can see, that was nothing really. We just hit a few landslides and snowdrifts and took a few downhill tumbles. <laughs> you know the deal. I sound like unforgettable life events to me. <laughs> anyway, you are correct. We haven't made it to the base camp yet. We have had extraordinarily poor luck over the last few days. Almost, Almost as if a sinister, sinister force has been, been trying to thwart our every move. Oh? Fortunately, Fortunately I made, I made advanced, advanced arrangements for Gerald, Gerald to remain in a safe location and conduct and some basic, basic physical training exercises. exercises. I'm sorry. I'm the one, one to blame, to blame for, all for all this. this. I've always I've had, had bad, bad luck and it always rubs, rubs off on everyone around me. Sorry, sorry to create so much extra trouble for everyone. I don't know what to say. Maybe, Maybe this, this is, is the, the awesome, awesome power, power of fate. fate. The scary, scary kind, I mean. Um, don't say that. It has nothing to do with fate. Um... It's kind of awkward when you have somebody in a situation that's putting the blame all on them and nobody's fucking saying anything. It's like, what the fuck? There's three of you, not one. You can't just blame everything all on one person. That's not fair. Unless they're deliberately the one causing problems, which I don't think so. You're in a fucking actual wilderness where shit happens all the time. Because a rock slide happens, you can't say, oh, that's my fault. That's like saying, oh, an avalanche happened today. Guess it was because of me. Like, that sounds stupid. You can't, you can't say shit like that. 
has nothing to do with fate, I assure you. <laughs> I agree. Why are you calling me right now? Alright, sorry about that. Um, they're just staring at me like, what the fuck? I got a phone call. Anyway, I'm not scared to be around you. Yeah, we're just used to it now. Besides, it's not like we have the most amazing luck ourselves. Yeah, like I ran into the Electro Archon, the Animal Archon, and the Geo Archon, and a bunch of other shit. And I also got this weird Fatui guy that thinks he's my husband, child. What? Really? I think you guys have way better luck than I do. No, 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 no. If you've seen all the shit I've been through through this game and all the adventures and everything, and my brother's like an evil son of a bitch, then no, I have worse luck than you, I assure you. What can we, we do about, about that? that? Oh, I know! How about Mama and share some of her luck with you? Uh oh. You're, You're welcome, welcome to a bit of mine too. too. Although, Although if the last few days are anything to go, to go by, by, seems in pretty short, short supply at the moment. Take some of mine too. You guys. <laughs> oh, thanks. <sighs> with a little, a little luck from everyone, everyone combined, combined, we'll make, we'll make it, it down, down this mountain, mountain for sure. sure. Why don't you guys just all pull out your wing gliders and glide down? I'm like, that's what I do. <laughs> yeah, you, you bet. bet. Watch them like super get stuck. Let me flip a treasure hoarder insignia to test it out. out. All, all right, right, it's tails. The, the opposite of what I guess. So you can predict your fortune this way? But why, why are you so happy that you got it wrong? Because heads means bad. It has, it has two, two sides, sides. So there's so a 50 50 chance of me getting it correct. Luck all, luck all comes, comes down, down to probability, probability too. too. So as so long, long as I use up all the bad luck, luck everything, everything else will go smoothly. You know, I must admit, I said I didn't really care for Bennett before, but I feel like he's slowly kind of growing on me. I like his design, he is cute, but there's just something about him where I just didn't really care. But I feel like the more I see him and get to hear from him a little more, I feel like I'm kind of changing my mind. I mean, I already have him as a character, I got him randomly by chance, but he's still not somebody I super care for, but... Like, be, like originally before, I didn't care for him at all, I was like, get out of my face. But now I'm like, eh, I kind of feel bad for him now. I guess this would be sympathy? Guessing, Guessing wrong, wrong when, when I flip, I flip an, an insignia, insignia is one, one way to use up some of the bad luck. luck. So, so, the, the probability, probability of having some good luck in the near future just, just got a little higher. higher. Uh... Hey, he's making no, no sense, sense at all. Why aren't, aren't you calling him out? Come on, he isn't you. <laughs> I'm actually polite to most people. I'm sure tr it's true. Um, I am. But I feel like if I say, come on, he isn't you, like it's going to seem like I have something against Paimon, and she's going to be like, hey, what does that mean? I don't- I mean, I kind of want to say that, because it's like the obvious answer, it's also the first response. I'm actually polite to most people. Watch would be like, oh, really? I wouldn't have guessed, or something sarcastic. I'm gonna poke a joke here and say, come on, he isn't you. Guys, I guess, I guess wrong with my insignia flip, flip. Which, which means we, we should, should be able, able to, to make, make it back, back to camp. camp! Why did you significantly get closer to me all of a sudden? Uh, I'm, I'm not, not sure, sure that's how it works. works. Let me try. It's this, this way, way right? right? Oh no. Why aren't we stopping him? Oh, 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 oh my butt! butt. What, what, what is this shard of ice doing here? here? Oh, that is that sounds painful. I don't want to imagine that. What, what, how truly miraculous. This is a miracle of misfortune. I don't, I don't usually, usually believe in luck, luck but, Bennett but Bennett makes, makes the, the best, best case for it I've ever seen. seen. Amber, Amber, if you if are you ever required, required to partner with Bennett, Bennett in the future work and you encounter, encounter anything like this again, again do, do not take, take any rash, rash action. action. Wait, Wait for me and, and I, will I will come, come to support, support you. you. Huh? Y yes, of course. Everyone must be exhausted. Now that you mention it, I do feel a little tired. Trekking in the mountains has a way of wearing you out. Well, not only that, walking in the snow in general, wearing the fucking clothes that they're wearing, I think you would die of hyperthermia within an hour. Well, since, since everyone, everyone is tired, tired why not take, take a rest in my camp? camp? I'm so sleepy. <sighs> a nice bowl of hot soup and a good sleep would sure be welcome right now. 
You're not going to bed. We got things to do. <sighs> Suddenly, I'm kind of sleepy too. Is the snow doing something to them? Amber will we'll fall asleep in the snow if we keep going much longer. Come on, let's move. We shall head to Albedo's camp and get some rest. Take stock of our supplies and decide how to get off this mountain. Pull out your wing glider and glide down for the second time. Oh my god. Why do they do this? Like, that's what I do. Or I just use teleport points, but I guess this is supposed to be realistic. Like, all you gotta do is pull out your wing glider like this. And... Wait, I saw it. Don't light. Don't fake me out. Are we gonna run into the twin here? I have a feeling that we might. I like how we're all just kind of looking around. Okay, that texture. Here we are. Make, Make yourselves yourself comfortable. comfortable. Weird. Oh, oh, I forgot. I uh, don't have that many chairs. Uh, please wait a moment. Why are you drawing in the middle of a time like this? You watch him draw them. What's he doing? Hanky? He is. He's, He's painting, painting a chair. A chair. Wait, Wait, alchemy, alchemy can, turn can turn paintings into objects? objects? How, How is this possible? My paintings are like blueprints. Alchemy simply enables me to omit the manufacturing part of the process. It's an elementary level technique. With enough research and experimentation, this same technique can even be used to create living beings. Which is how he was created. Whoa. Well, well, since, since you, can you can magically, magically produce, produce chairs, chairs, can, can I, have I have one, one of the, the backrest? Back I'll have a stool. No problem. How, How many of you, you want, want backrests? Me! me. <laughs> <laughs> They're just standing there wide-eyed, not saying anything. Me! Me! me. I'll, I'll also, also take, take one, one with a backrest, back if you please. Can I not have a chair that comes with a juicer? A whole chair is way too big for you, Shirley. In a moment, I'll be able to quickly create five chairs for everyone to use. Oh, we have, we have chairs, chairs now! now. <laughs> this, is this is so, so comfortable. comfortable! Makes me want to stay the night here. here. I wonder, did Albedo actually create his other self, Durin? But I thought he said that him and Durin were created by some other woman in Conria, so maybe not. You're very welcome to stay overnight if you wish. Um... Uh... No, that's okay. There's still some time before dinner. <laughs> Get some rest, everyone. I'll tend the stove. Hey, now. We can't be letting you do all the work. I can help. Please, put me to work. Don't say that. My mind is going south as shit. Speak to him. Hold on just a second. Can I, can I talk to you for a minute? I wonder, I wonder if, if there's, there's anything, anything I could, I could do, do to help out. out. Ask what there is. What happened today? <laughs> Sorry for dragging you guys into another situation. I didn't used to know any of these knights very well. But after spending some time with them on this trip, it's really opened my eyes to my own shoulders. And another call again? Sorry about that again. I've been so busy, people keep calling me for to do things and... Uh... What was he saying? Okay. They're all so, so talented, talented and kind. kind. I have a I lot to learn from them. them. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. You gotta you tell me sometime how you managed to make friends with so many talented, talented people. people. Um, how are you holding up? <laughs> you know me. Same, Same old bet. Unlucky, unlucky as ever. ever. But as long as, as bad luck doesn't break me, me I'll always get back, back up again. again. Especially, Especially on a cool adventure like this one. I gotta make the most of it. All right, I'll leave you in peace. Or actually, let's go, let's go through all dialogues about dragons. Fine. <sighs> I feel, I feel bad. bad. It's, it's hard, hard knowing that, that I've been causing, causing so much, so much trouble, trouble for everyone. everyone. This angle is weird. Being, Being a little, a little unlucky, unlucky is usually no big deal for me, but, but in a place, place like this, it makes, it makes me worry, worry that, that something really bad might come of it. I like how Lumine isn't actually looking at him. No, no wait, wait, I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said that. that. I might have actually jinxed it now. About the rookie. Oh, you mean Gerald? I heard, I heard that, that Eula developed, developed a whole training program for him. He might, might be new, but I bet he'll improve pretty quickly with a mentor, mentor like that. 
All right, I'll leave you in peace. Okay, okay cool. cool. Make, Make sure, sure you eat plenty, plenty when dinner's, dinner's ready. ready. Well, dinner's on my way. That's what that call that I got was about. Hello? This, this is, is quite, quite cozy, cozy for, for Dragonspine. Dragonspine. I'm, I'm pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. surprised. What happened today? If you're, if talking, you're talking about, about Bennett's situation, situation, I think, I think I'm, I'm used, used to it now. now. It's, it's hardly, hardly the end of the world. world. Don't, Don't ruminate, ruminate on it. it. Take, Take this, this chance to get, to get some proper rest. rest. The, nights the nights are long on Dragonspine. A glass of ice-cold wine would not go amiss right now. How are you holding up? Me? I'm coping, I'm coping perfectly, perfectly well. well. I, don't I don't need looking, need looking after. after. I need to look at her voice actress and see who it is, because she sounds a lot like the Electro Archon almost, and I'm like, wait a minute. You should talk, talk to Amber and Bennett. Bennett. They're, They're not, not as, as well, well acquainted with, with Dragonspine, Dragonspine as I am. Seeing, seeing how, how much you can, you can find, find to talk about, about even with Albedo, you, you must be quite, quite the conversationalist. conversationalist. So, so put that skill to good use. Teach them all how to survive on Dragonspine. I'm sure, I'm sure this, this is, is well, well within your capability, capability. No. no? Yeah, it is. So about that snowman. I gave I it a try, try, and I, I actually, actually quite enjoyed it. <laughs> what? But Amber, Amber said, said the snowman, snowman I made was too artistic. artistic. Apparently, Apparently, the conventional, conventional style is more rotund, rotund in, appearance. in appearance. I couldn't, I couldn't tell if she was complimenting me or mocking me. me. Either, Either way, way, I'm not, I'm not about, about to let, let it go. go. Such anger. So, about Dragonspine. I'm quite, I'm quite familiar, familiar with, with Dragonspine, Dragonspine by now, but this time, I have, I have a newcomer to worry about. about. And I'm and traveling in a group with Amber and the others. Not, not things I'm terribly well accustomed to. to. Still, Still, I've, I've taken, taken the job, job. So, so of course, course I'll, I'll do what's asked, asked of me to the fullest of my ability. ability. I'll settle this score once this is all over. Alright, I'll leave you in peace. Don't mind me. Just do whatever you like. Yeah, I'll do whatever I like, like touching this crafting table, rubbing my hands all over it. <laughs> oh, what is that? Okay. Hey, you want to make a thing for me? Ooh. Mm. Yeah, those little insignias. I guess I manually have to find them. Hey, what's up? <sighs> it's so it's nice, nice and warm, warm here. How are you holding up? Or actually, what happened today? Oh, oh all that? that? Uh, don't, don't worry, worry about, about it. it. Yuma, Yuma is a, is a good, good person. person. She, she might, might not, not show it, it but she'd she never, never let, let that kind of stuff get to her. her. As, As for Bennett, he, he seems, seems like, like the kind of guy who can keep his spirits up when things aren't going well. well. I, feel I feel bad, bad having to ask so, so much of Albedo, Albedo, though. Still, Still it's, it's kind of nice, nice to have everyone together like this, so yay for silver linings! So, how are you holding up? You know, when I was keeping Joel company, I started missing my grandfather really bad. After, After he disappeared, disappeared I, never I never saw him again. again. I have no, no idea, idea how he's doing. I understand the sentiment. Um, back in October, my grandfather was diagnosed with bladder cancer. It was growing on top of his bladder, and he underwent surgery to have it removed. And then about a week later, he was diagnosed with dementia. And he currently, that's what he's dealing with right now. And he's actually not doing so well, so... I can sympathize with that more than you know. I sympathize with that a lot, actually. But at, but at least, least what, what I can do is focus, focus on being a great outrider. outrider. If, if I can I do that well, I know he'd, he'd be proud. So, about Joel. Joel's, Joel's been, been doing pretty good. good. Having, Having people, people to play with has put him in a good, good mood. mood. I'll, I'll tell you what, though. though. He seems he to have even more stamina, stamina than me. <laughs> well, he's a kid, so... So long, so long as they're playing, playing kids, kids always seem to have endless amounts of energy. Yep, so about Dragonspine. It's, it's more, more dangerous, dangerous up here than I thought. In a, in a hostile, hostile environment, environment like this, this even a knight of Favonius has to keep their eyes open and keep, and keep their wits, wits about them at all times. times. Still, Still, this, this has been a pretty, pretty unique, unique adventure for me. For me. It's, it's definitely, definitely been worth it. it. All right, I'll leave you. Sure, sure thing. That you're, you're tired, tired as well. well. You, you should get some rest too. No, I'm actually freaking fine. What is wrong with you? Um. Oh, pace yourself. Dinner could be a while. I still have a few things to prepare. Oh? Uh, about the 
pain. What happened today? Oh, don't worry about it. A chance like this to gather around the fire and chat into the night is a rare and precious one for me. You're coming on really strong and it makes me feel weird. I won't participate in the conversation much. It's just a habit of mine. But please know that I am enjoying the atmosphere all the same. Okay. Of course. I'm happy to continue chatting with you if you'd like. Don't say it like that. What are you doing? <laughs> Um, so how are you holding up, though? I mean, are you alright? <laughs> I, I wish I could simply respond with, I'm fine. But you are a true friend to me. So I should be honest with you. You're making me feel really weird. It's kind of like an uncomfortable feeling in a way. Uh, okay? Recently, certain questions have been occupying my mind. Questions about the nature of life and creation. Yeah, actually, you weren't, you weren't, you're synthetically created. You're not actually created the way normal people are, okay? However, I feel that rushing into a discussion with you on these topics before my ideas on them are fully formulated will bring me far more confusion and clarity. Yeah, if I was to explain to you how real people create children, I don't know if you'd want to know that. We're not going there. So, I will wait till my thoughts are clear in my own head before I share them with you. Until then, please forgive me. Don't say it like that. Alright, well then, um, tell me about Dragonspine since you clearly live here. Even now, I don't believe I have fully grasped the nature of the threat that Dragonspine poses, but I will endeavor to keep you safe. That much you can trust in. Um, okay. God, he makes me feel weird. So about that paint. I hadn't expected you to be so interested in paint. I once tried grinding mist flowers into powder and mixing it with white paint to replicate the sparkle of snowflakes. The end result was quite satisfactory. But works that use this kind of paint need to be stored carefully. If you want to try it for yourself, I can help you. Don't say it like that! Oh my god! Everything he says! Oh my god! Anyway... It's almost ready now. Travel. Don't say it like that! Please light the campfire and gather everyone for dinner. <laughs> I'm okay. Oh man. Do I just walk up to it and light it? I feel like I should use Amber to shoot it, but I'm gonna try my bear. All right, please do not set Amber on fire. Yes. The bear is still in the cutscene. We're not gonna worry about that. Um. I made a few dishes based on some popular Mondstadt recipes. This is no good hunter, but there should be enough to go around. Please help yourselves. Wow. wow, smells great. great. Don't, don't mind, mind if I, I do. do. Wait, Wait, don't, don't steal, steal all, all the fried, fried vegetables. vegetables. Uh, leave some for me. me. Hey! <laughs> Everyone enjoys dinner around an open fire. Oh, hi, hi, my spoon. What, what a great meal. meal. Albedo, Albedo, you're, you're too, too modest. modest. These, These dishes, dishes are as good as anything, anything you find in the top restaurant. restaurant. Are all oh, alchemists so good at cooking? You, you may, may be onto, onto something there. there. Right? Kinda I think so too. It's his last man that gives it away. The kind of guy who holds a potion bottle as steady as a rock isn't the kind of guy who's gonna be slap gas with the salt and pepper. <laughs> Actually, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Glad to see he's enjoying himself. Um kind of getting awkward now. I'm so sleepy after all that food. Why do I feel like he did something to it and put them all to sleep? I mean, they said that they were tired before, right? But I feel like he might have did something. Did Bennett fall asleep sitting up? <laughs> he must be totally wiped out. It's been a rough few days. The way he's sleeping is so alert. I'm impressed. Why are we all just watching him sleep? Are we a bunch of freaks or something? 
There are people in this world that do that. They like to watch other people sleep, and I don't know why. He seems to be in a deep sleep. Why are we all poking fun at him like he's a little dog or something? Oh, oh no, Dad, no apples for me. I want sticky honey roast and fisherman's toast. Sticky honey roast? That's your favorite, isn't it, Amber? Mmm, sure is. Give me a sticky honey roast from Good Hunter any day. I used to take you to Good Hunter a lot back when we first met. Before long, Sarah would start cooking our usual orders as soon as she saw us coming. She said we ordered the same thing so often that it was practically muscle memory by that point. <laughs> she also said that if everyone in Mondstadt ordered like we do, her job would be so much easier. All she'd have to do is memorize everyone's favorites. Yeah, but just because you have a favorite doesn't mean you get it all the time. There might be some days where you're like, oh, I don't want this, I want that, or something, you know. <coughs> Always oh, eating together. Aww, it's nice that, that you two are so, so close. close. The traveler and I might always eat together too. It's a sure sign of true friendship. Two people simply sharing a meal says nothing either way about the relationship between them. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> that depends if it's a one-off meal or a regular occurrence. He's not wrong. Whenever Nula doesn't want to admit to something, she raises her chin or puts her hands on her hips. <laughs> or crosses her arms and looks the other way. Ah, you've all picked up on that. Didn't know Eula's tells were so easy to spot. We are done here, yes. I am free to go, am I not? Then please excuse me. I have a frozen lake I need to be at. You're going for an ice bath at this time of night? W wait up! Don't go and help me! I thought you wanted to get some sleep. So maybe you should, should stay here and rest. rest. She's like, I'm not gonna let you look at me nude, you freak. No, I should, I should come, come with, with you. you. It's, it's late, late and, and it's dark, dark. and you're, you're not, not good with directions, directions like, like I am. Come, come on, on, let's, let's go, go together. together. <laughs> <laughs> they both have, everybody has the same walk animation. Right yeah. <sighs> Rather, Rather them than Pokemon. So much roast meat. Okay. Oh, hey, Dad. I'm doing all right. A leader of my own adventure team now. Wow. There really is a sleep talker. Okay. Looks like we got some downtime next. All right, you two. Time to paint. Time for me to show you what I can do. Prepare to be amazed. I don't know about that. We don't even really know how, do we? Oh my god. Um. Uh, Have you decided what to paint? Actually, no, but she's probably gonna wind up painting her brother. <laughs> Why do you even need to ask? It's obviously going to be Paimon! Okay, Paimon it is. Sure. But, but we should move elsewhere. elsewhere. We're likely to disturb Bennett's sleep if we stay here, so let's go outside. Okay. Ah. Get up, Shangling. <clears throat> ice mountain for an ice child. I like how he keeps trying to lure me away by himself. Have you noticed that? Hmm. Let's be here. Uh... Hey! What's what that, that look for? for? Cut the attitude and start putting your perfect Paimon down on the page! You better take this seriously, cause this is going on Paimon's wall! I'll humor Paimon. Alright then. <laughs> I don't know what to say here. I'll humor her? She probably ain't gonna find it. I'll just say, no, alright then. Confidence is a good thing. Those, Those to whom it is endowed do well to flaunt it. I'm looking forward to the finished piece. Oh no, watch it be a freaking disaster. Oh. I like how the grass moves around his feet. Alright. 
Don't look at me like that. I'm trying. Paimon's all out of brain juice. Paimon's peeved, dopey, but adorable. <laughs> Paimon's all out of brain juice. I can't see your face from this angle. I'm gonna say dopey, but adorable. Um. I'm gonna just say it because it's funny. Huh? Is that how Paimon really looks to you? No. Okay, forget it. We can come back to that. Let's move on to the party! Come on! Pay what you see when you look at Paimon. A top tier flying pet, top quality emergency food. <laughs> Everybody probably said that. Alright, top tier flying pet. Uh, Paimon's starting to feel like this is not going to turn out so great. Now Paimon's getting nervous. I'm, I'm done. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Right, I'm pretty happy with it. Why you? How could it? How could it last The brushwork is smooth, and the composition seems professional quality. You had no problems there. So what the heck happened with the face, huh? Explain that stupid expression. Explain it. Uh, smooth, professional quality. Previously received any education in the fine arts? He looks like it's horrible. No, but art comes from the heart, so very, very little. I'm gonna say heart comes from the heart. I just wanted to convey how special you are. Fascinating. <laughs> Paimon, if this is not to your liking, I can make a few amendments. Uh, Traveler, what do you think? Do whatever. Albedo make some improvements to the artwork. Okay. <sighs> Alright then. Paimon, is this better? Albedo, you... Wow. 